So welcome to the Espresso Kitchen where we're making something delicious with one of our favorite chefs, Chef Moira, this morning. We're making cupcakes, but cupcakes with a difference. We're adding beetroot to them because we all know that you can add carrot to your bakes. So why not add beetroot? Chef Moira, lovely to have you with Hi. us again. Thank you for having me. Yeah. It's really great to be here. I love this. Interesting. Beetroot cupcakes. Yes, no, um, I love beetroot cupcakes. Um, and I think the, the viewers and the people out there will also like beetroot cupcakes. A lot of people are already doing it. Um, not so much as in cupcakes, but as in cake. Um, it creates a nice um, earthy flavor. Um, and also adds in that extra nutrition. And also, beetroot is used for red velvet cakes, and it's a really big thing, red velvet cake. People love it. Yeah. Um, you're now getting blue velvet cake, but we don't have blue beetroot. But um, <laughs> red velvet cake looks better, and it looks more wholesome, yeah. um, looks more appealing. And th the great thing about what I love about this beetroot is that I've used a coup beetroot. And, and it's already been cooked and grated um, right. for me. I mean, I hate cooking beetroot at home because you boil it, and you boil it, and it takes so long, and you have to peel it, and your hands get red and pink, and yeah. us women with our nails, we never get the colour out. <laughs> yeah, that's fine. So, you don't yes. have to worry about this so, one this morning. So this is a very quick and easy one. We don't even have to use a mixer. We're going to mix it by hand. All right. Um, it's a nice moist cupcake. And then we're going to put a little piece of chocolate in the middle. So when you Ooh. bite into it, it's, it's like this chocolate explosion. And we're going to put a nice rich chocolate ganache on the top. Let's okay. put this together, Moira. So we've got eggs in, in your yes. bowl. And you're going to stir for me, I see. Yes, yeah, so well, oh. I've got the whisk. I'm ready. Oh, so you, can I start going? Well, use your big muscles today. <laughs> All right. All right. That's good. That's good. Give right. you a bit so of a workout this morning. We've um, got eggs and oil. And I'm going to use moss. Now moss, you can use moss or buttermilk or milk. But I like moss because it helps keep the, the cupcakes nice and moist. So oh, does okay. buttermilk. And yes. buttermilk, buttermilk is generally used in a um, red velvet cake. Yes. So this is really a spin-off of a red velvet, but it's with a beetroot added right. to it. So you just whisk it up nice and easy. Then we're going to add in our sugar. All right, there we go. And what we want to do is obviously you, the sugar to start melting. Um, and we're going to add in the, some cocoa. Oh, so look at we, that. Once that starts um, incorporating into the eggs, then we'll fold in the flour, and then lastly we'll add in the beetroot. That's it. All right, you're doing a great job there. You know, I've, I've done my fair share mixing, eh? Okay, so <laughs> just slowly um, stir it so you don't get flour all over the place. That's it. Right. Well, you're this scared. Is, huh? You're scared we're making a mess. It's fine, well, we can make I a mess. I don't like to be white, you know, white and fluffy. <laughs> <laughs> All right, no, I'll try and spare you from that. Just not put me in the oven, so you know, <laughs> let's keep me nice and clean. Perfect. All right, so now you'll see it's coming together. Yeah. Um, I, I use self-raising flour, so yeah. and that's why you'll find there's no raising that's agent. It. I think at this stage I'm going to swap over. Swap over to your spatula. To my grab it to me. other utensil. Turkey. All right which I find is also matching my shirt this morning, by the way, which is great. All right, so we're going to fold in the beetroot, and all I've done here is drained yeah. all the excess the liquid, um, yeah. liquid off. Okay, Perfect. so you can fold that in. All right. If you don't like the texture of beetroot pieces, yeah. you could chop it smaller. But I quite like okay. it rustic, so that when you bake it, um, yeah. when you bite into it, you still get that sweetness and that earthy flavour yes. of the beetroot coming through. And look at that. All right, and that's how easy it is. So don't stir it anymore. You don't want to um, take on any of the air. Um, we really meant to be just a quick and easy. Yes, yeah, sorry. Well, so we're going over there because I'm sure you would like to get your hands on the recipe. If you do, you can just e uh, SMS the keyword coup to 33728. Very easy. We'll send you the shopping list. Also add a link to the recipe that you can go follow. Just keep in mind those SMSs do cost 1 Rand 50, but it's coup to 33728. All right, so what we're going to do, I'm going to show you an easy way of um, filling your muffin tins. Okay. Um, you can use any size. Okay, I've, I've chosen to use a medium size tin. Yeah. And we've sprayed it with spray and cook. We need to just um, you could use um, baking paper, you know, the, the cupcake yes, yes, yes. holders. Um, but I'm going to just use it like this. So it's easy to use two tablespoons. All and right. then you use the one and you, you put it down. That's it. And um, then you keep that one in there all the time and this one in your hand. And then you take a piece of chocolate, put oh, it in the middle. Look at that. And then you take a little bit more. And, and you, you just top it, it like that. And you do that, you do it three quarters all the way full, because you don't want to make it too full, yes, otherwise, otherwise it's going to, um, when you it bakes, it will... one big square cupcake, which yeah, you don't Yeah, and it doesn't look very <laughs> appetizing. So I'm going to carry on doing this. We're going to put it in the oven, and then we'll show the viewers how they look when they bake. Sounds baked. great. You go ahead. You, you bake at 180. Please remember to preheat your oven beforehand. When you start, okay. preheat your oven for 20 to 25 minutes. All right, easy as that. The keyword, once again, if you want to get your hands on the recipe for our beetroot cupcakes this morning, SMS coup to 33728. But if you want to see how we put these guys together one more time, here's your chance. Chop coup beetroot until very fine. Mix eggs, oil, and mass. Mix flour, cocoa, and sugar. Stir in the beetroot and egg mixture. Spoon tablespoon of mixture into each muffin cup. Put one block of chocolate in the middle. Then top with more mixture. Bake for 25 minutes. For the icing, heat mass 
add butter and chocolate. Stir until melted. Allow to cool, then slightly whip it up. For the full recipe, visit the Expresso Morning Show Facebook page or log on to expressoshow.com. You can also SMS the keyword COO to 33728 to receive the shopping list on your phone. Just click on the link provided to view the recipe. SMS cost one rand fifty. No free SMSs and T's and C's apply. And would you look at that beautiful, nice and festive. Once again, that keyword, if you want to get uh, the recipe for our beetroot cupcakes this morning, is KU. SMS that to 33728. We'll send you everything you need to know. Moira, that looks amazing. Yeah, they came out really well. I'm quite pleased with them. Yeah. And we've just put a little bit of chocolate ganache on the top. All right. um, and now we're just sort of finishing it off with a, a curl of chocolate. And generally, the viewers can just take some chocolate and then they use the potato peeler. And then yeah. they will just take it down the side and then That's they can cool it. And it, it helps if your chocolate is a little bit harder. Yeah. Um, so pop it in the fridge for a little while. Pop it in the fridge, yeah. All right. um, or they can just grate it. Or grate um, it. Yeah, so it just finishes off a little bit. The ganache you need to, um, if you want in, ours is a dark chocolate that we've used, is a bit bitter. If you, if you want in it sweeter, then add a, a, do use a milk chocolate. Moira, thanks again for sharing this morning. Gearing up for the festive season. I absolutely love it. But once again, if you want to get your hands on the uh, recipe for our beetroot cupcakes this morning, the keyword is QSM is that to 33728. Also, if you have any interesting bakes that you use beetroot in, why not share those uh, recipes? with us you can email it to food at expressoshow.com and we'd love to take a look and maybe make it on the show with Moira. Only the best cooks serve Koo because they know it's carefully grown and made with meticulous attention. So when you serve Koo, you can trust you serving only the best.